All right, welcome to my exotic weapon guide. So if you weren't aware, there are four exotic weapons on the map currently. That's it. Simply four. All the rest of them have been removed. So I'm going to show you the exact location for all four of these exotic weapons. Just to help you out, this might be a bot. Sorry, buddy. So the first one, which coincidentally is my absolute favorite, and I'm glad they brought it back, is right here in the dance building. You can see the NPC spawns in here. And it's actually a really colorful NPC. This is Power Cord right here. And if you weren't aware, by the way, NPCs do give you items when you talk to them. So I got 100 stone there. So she offers the Shadow Tracker Pistol. Like I said, my favorite exotic, and it's 400 gold for this. You can also hire her for 95. And she also has various quests, such as collect a mechanical part. And then one of the easiest ones in the game, emote on a disco platform. So you can do this right here right here where she is look at this super easy 120 gold right there but again this is the first exotic weapon the shadow tracker let me show you the exact location it's just southwest from misty meadows right here to the left of this little snow covered mountain and again this is the dance cabin shadow tracker right here all right the next exotic weapon can be found right over here in slurpy swamp this is not the same npc that was here last season that was big chuggis this time we've got someone else and he's kind of in a different spot as well it's none other than slurp jonesy so again talk to him to get your free item and he sells the chug cannon but it's a whopping 600 he says the slurp knows so you can also buy a shield potion for 120 reach 100 of both health and shield and then destroy slurp barrels which is super easy to do because there should be tons of slurp barrels right near here so the exact location for this one is right here in the northeast aspect of Slurpy Swamp. Great item, two super easy challenges to do. Good stuff. We got someone YT in here. Can we win versus a YT? Probably not, but we're gonna try. Ooh, that hurts, that hurts, white tear, that hurts. Wowee. So that was two of the exotics. There's two more to show. All right, so the next exotic weapon is probably the hardest one to get, and that's simply because where it's located. So this is a super popular area. This is the Durburger and Log Jam. So the reason this is so popular is because of the NPC that's here. So let me show you what I mean. Once we get in here, hopefully we can clear the whole area before this guy shoots me in the butt with his arrow. All right, finally, the coast is clear. So let me show you why this is one of the best places to land. It's Mr. Gut Bomb here. So look at this. He sells the Hop Rock Dooleys, which is the third exotic on the map. But also, you can challenge him for a purple spaz anytime you want. He always spawns with this. All you have to do is beat him in a duel. So that is why this is super popular. All the sweats come here just because they want this purple shotgun. But like I said, in addition, he does have the exotic Hop Rock Duelies for 500. Now you can also hire him for 95. You can eliminate enemy players and you can collect meat. So here we go. There we go, I almost died to him, holy smokes. So, super popular landing spot. Here's the exact location. Again, he's in the Durburger. Gut Bomb is the NPC, super great spot to land. Lots of good stuff here. Like that? Thanks for the boots, kid. All right, the fourth and final exotic weapon on the map is sold by Mr. Burnout himself, and it's the Dub Shotgun, another one of my favorite exotic weapons. So Burnout can be found right down here just southwest of Steamy Stacks. Let's see what he offers. I've never been here yet. So the Dub 
is 600, so kind of expensive. He can reveal nearby cars, which is pretty useless. You can destroy stop signs, reach a speed of 50 miles in a vehicle, and collect a gas can, which is super easy because he's got one right next to him. So let's just do that real quick, and we'll pick it up. So let's just get the dub for old time's sakes. It's kind of expensive, like I said, but I want it. 600 for that, no refunds, lots of gold. Thanks, Burnout. All right, so there you go. Those were all four exotic weapons on the map. So one more time, we've got at the dance house down here, the Shadow Tracker. We've got the Chug Cannon right here in Slurpy Swamp. We've got the Hop Rock Dooleys over here at the Dur Burger. And last but not least, we have the Dub southwest of Steamy Stacks. So interesting choice of exotics. I'm sure as the season progresses, more exotics will come back. But for the time being, they only brought back those four. Now, to be honest, those are four of the most useful exotics in the game. So I'm glad they at least brought these back. That's all there is to it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. A like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which is TaborTime.